welcome back everybody to funky the star tv in this particular uh, segment uh, we are taking a look on uh, malami hmm? and the abakiare and also abakiare's extradition hmm? why we delayed approval for dcp abakiare's extradition so uh, make we take a look see the reason why when malami and his group hmm? delay the uh, approval of uh, Abakiare's extradition. Remember, say yesterday, the news broke broke out everywhere when they tell the whole world say they don't already approve. Say the one extradite the criminal and disgraced DCP Abakiare to uh, America. Hmm? Uh -huh. Remember, DCP Abakiare don't first commit crime with hush puppy, and he make FBI the you know search for him everywhere, every nick and cranny in Nigeria. FBI they wait for Abakiare, hmm? and again in Congo commit another grievous offense when bothered selling of drug. Hmm? When they can get big wahala with this what they call the N D L O E A in. Nigeria today, Malami won't tell us the reason why when they delay the uh, approval of Abakiare's extradition. Nahimbiri Mata won't want to take a look into Abubakar Malami, the Attorney General of the Federation (AGF) have explained why it took time for the federal government to approve the extradition of Abakiare suspended. Deputy Commissioner of Police. The man a Deputy Commissioner of Police. Brother, not be small rank when this Abakiare been get before. But because of greed. Hmm? Mm -hmm. In Congo put in hand in different, different bad things. Congo commit crime when we say the no fit forgiver. No be only say the man go do uh, 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 for one night business with uh, Abbas aka uh, Hush Puppy. The man Congo they sell drug. So Malami they tell us now see he gets some certain reasons when make the government delay the approval hmm, of the man extradition. The Attorney General on Tuesday filed an application before the chief judge of the Federal High Court in Abuja for Kiaris extradition. They don't the find the application. Say they must to send that guy when be Abakiare to America. Making go answer the name. In this article, they can't write about the application number hmm? uh -huh. filed under the extradition act. In a statement on Wednesday, Malami through his spokesperson, Uma Gwandu, said the process of extradition is is cumbersome and motivated. Okay? As you are aware, extradition is a process that involves motivated component. The statement read, the components are usually multi-territorial, international, local, and judicial. Submission of requests from the consigned party to the relevant authority constitutes one of such components. The Office of the Attorney General of the Federation and Minister of Justice received the extradition request in respect of the officer in question. After true studies and reviews of issue regarding the application and component, thereof, the Office of the Attorney General of Federation and the Minister of Justice processed the application and forwarded some of the relevant authorities for further necessary action. Kerry is wanted in the United States for conspiracy to commit wire fraud and money laundering and identity theft. Now, the man don't come tell us, see, to extradite somebody, it is very, very complicated because the matter have to go through many, many processes. Okay, many people have to sign the whole thing before you know, uh, the extradition. And uh, the matter is not all that easy like that, according to the way when they tell us right here. 
In July 2021, the U.S. Federal Bureau of Investigation, FBI, indicted Gary in a $1.1 million fraud involving Hush Poppy, self-confessed international four star. The suspended police officer denied the allegation, claiming that he, with Abba Kiari, hands a claim. In August 2021, Usman Baba, Inspector General of Police, received the report of a panel set up to probe the allegation against the officer. Oh, I don't hear now. The man saying hand they clean, but as in hand they clean, they still want to portray him to the United States of America. Now, when I say the issue of uh, the, uh, extraditing somebody or someone, they very, very complicated. And that is why they take on all this kind of time. We, the people of Nigeria, no see, if not because of this drug issue, Abba Kiari for not go anywhere. Abba Kiari for not go anywhere. And the second, when Una go carry the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra from Kenya, now only one day Una take do this thing. Why come be say, extraditing Mazin and the Kano, Una can still go through all these useless processes when Una try to claim. We know, see, the northern people and the northern elite, they wanted to die this matter. But Abakari Congo commit another offense, join this one, because they know we must send this man to America. Another thing will happen with that. So anybody, when they tell you, see, now they delay because the thing have to go table to table and people have to sign before they go fit as to this man, then they lie to you. They wanted to die this matter. So my question to Abakari, my question to this man when be the AGF and the man when the Usman Baba and the man when they speak for him and the FGBC, why can't be seen when una one extradite Mazin and the Kano, na only one single day on a take carry Mazin and the Kano come back to Nigeria? All these processes when they claim see they go through that it something have to go through table to table. Why if I have to go through table to table? Why must man the camera who not can take time like this and delay like this? Why not go through table to table? No, so this is the level of impunity when the uh, AGF and the Nigerian government that they commit serious impunity. Okay, the law not the equal to everybody in that country. We don't talk this matter in 2019. The law not the equal to everybody. Everybody get the way when they take treat them in that country. According to what they the here, they not the claims that them be the first class citizen. These same full and people, when all of them are foreigners, only God know where they come from. Now then they claim that them be first class before we when be the people when get the country. Now so the matabio concerning um, Abakari. But again, we the here now say he get another case when the one begin judge in Nigeria, but in Abakari. So the thing is complicated. We never know until when we will see Abakari day in the hand of FBI people. Okay. Hang out, enjoy bottles of drinks. Kano tells Legatin. Now the Kano now we won't talk about now again. Intel in men, the people when they work for them. That is his legal team, the lawyers. See, so made them hang out, made them enjoy some bottles of drink. Okay, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra Mazin and the Kano has expressed optimism that despite his audio before Justice Bintan Yanku of the Federal High Court of Abuja, where he is facing trial over alleged terrorism, victory is certain. So, in the canon now, they tell Una, when be sabot twice, when they inside IPO, they say, in they come out to, in the, in the express say, he must to come out, no matter the kind of uh, 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 treatment, whether they give him in DSS custody, no matter how the judges then concord things, no matter how federal government concord things on top, he said, in they tell all of us, say, his victory is certain, meaning say, he must prevail against those uh, against the enemy of the Biafran people. All of us know the, who the enemies of Biafran people are. There are a lot of them, a lot, a lot of them in that country. When they sabotage the effort of the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, Uche Mofo don't come out to the talk nonsense again. 
So I don't tell them say if when I say Mazen man they cannot commit crime or get one reasonable felon when they commit somewhere or somehow, then make on arrest Uche Mofo because Uche Mofo na former deputy leader of the IPOB people before Ingongo jump ship enter her fire with a uh, asari the kubo hmm? so they continue the leader of the indigenous people of biafra ipob mazana nakano has expressed optimism right Kanon currently being detained in the custody of the department of State service dss has therefore requested his legal team to always make our time to hang out and enjoy some bottles of drink now the man is a very good man in they tell his legal team see me they make out their own time sometimes to go drink but not go and and get drunk go drink go enjoy your life anyhow you want to enjoy your life at least sometimes and it's what doing and it's all about life so the man they tell his legal team see me that they make out time to always you know enjoy yourself whenever they want just to have a couple of uh, drinks leader of his legal team ifan yejofo said this in a statement on Friday issued after a routine visit to Kano in the headquarters of the SS Abuja. Now on Friday now when Ifanye Jofo Nahin come out when in they make this comment. Says this one now waiting our leader Mazen Nanda Kano tell us or ask us to do. We could go out, you know, to you know the time when he visit the leader of the Jesus of Biafra in uh, Headquarter of the DSS in Abuja. And now him must not come and make that comment. He made them always make out their time to, you know, enjoy yourself, you know, you know, take care of some couple of drinks. He said, the court ordered return visit to our indefatigable client, Union Dumas and Nandekano, was observed on Thursday, March 3, 2022, 2022 after this, which turned into weeks of grandstanding we were able to meet with our client Onyandu Mazen Namde Kamo in his unshaking on the tar resolve Onyandu was in high spirit as he took time to explain why he why he protested against the denial of access to his lawyers during the last three successive visits so ladies and gentlemen when i don't hear everything now he was deeply troubled with those incidents particularly when it was done in flagrant disregard and violation of extent orders of the court we understood union dues gross the op and seized the opportunity to intimate him of the measure we have taken so far to ensure that such ugly incident does not recur again. So now here we will drop this matter. Nam the canon a good person when not supposed to be there. I don't ask Abaribe and his group where on a day. On a say on a be evil leaders, on a get ball. We know Abaribe don't try for Nam the canon before. But you got to stand where you stand. Don't shake Mr. Abaribe. Because people they accord some you know level of respect to Mr. Abaribe. Please don't deviate. Don't sabotage the effort of Nandekano. Please stand with Nandekano the way you stand with him right from onset. Because Biafran people and IP will be in general. They have some kind of level of respect when they accord to you as one of their man when they know in that Biafra land. The way when they respect Abaribi, not be the way when nobody they respect um, Ojos or Kalo that way. No one, nobody they respect the whole governors that way. The way when IPOB and Nigerian people they carry Abaribi towards this uh, struggle. Those effort. We still give you kudos. But stand up and stand up uprightly for Mazi Nanakano. Not let anybody deceive you. Follow fight this fight so that the leader of the people of Biafra will finally regain freedom. Thank you everyone and make sure she on the subscribe and share our videos to any particular platform when you know say you day 
just share my video all right voila